Hey guys, how are you? In this video, I'm going to talk about the Qualcomm's 3D Sonic Sensor. So, Qualcomm announced several things at its Snapdragon Technology Summit, including one that may very well be for the Galaxy S10's in display fingerprint sensor. It has long been reported that the S10 will feature the best in display fingerprint sensor Qualcomm has to offer. And Yesterday, the company provided more details about this component. Qualcomm is calling it the 3D Sonic Sensor. Qualcomm says that the sensor will ship in mobile devices that will be available in the first half of 2019. Samsung is laid to launch smartphone with the in-display fingerprint sensor. Many of its Chinese rivals have already done so, but Samsung has been waiting for the ultrasonic solution. Now let's take a look at the differences between the ultrasonic sensors and the optical sensors. The optical sensor works by shining light on your finger when it is pressed on the display and it makes a 2D print of your finger. Whereas Qualcomm's 3D sonic sensor does things a bit differently. It doesn't just store a flat image of the finger pressed against the display. The ultrasonic capability is what enables the sensor to develop a 3D mold of the finger by bouncing sound waves off the skin. And the ultrasonic capability enables this sensor to capture incredible detail right down to the ridges and pores that are unique for everyone. This capability makes the sensor more accurate and safe as compared to the optical sensor. Hey right, guys, that is all for today. Subscribe to my channel, share this video, like this video, comment down your questions in the comment section below. I'll surely try to answer them. And please do turn on the bell notifications so that you can get notified about my future videos. I'll see you in my next video. But for now, let's call it a day.